Good morning, Marmy. Actually, that's not true. Good night, Marmy. It's like nine o'clock on Saturday, August 11th, and I'm here packing for our trip to the Poconos Mountains. Is it Pocono or Poconos? I don't know. Anyways, so I'm not even done packing. We're leaving tomorrow morning. We're gonna be there for a couple of days with Harvard's family and I'm stressed because there is like a flood warning and there's non-stop rain the entire time we're there. But we are gonna stay positive, we're gonna pack our stuff and have an amazing time. I'm staying optimistic. But before we get into the entire video, if you're new to my channel, my name is Tina. I'm the mom of three. Uh, there's always laundry on my dining table, like over here. I put out videos here on YouTube three times a week. I hope you'll consider subscribing and joining the Marmy. So like the mom army, Marmy, get it? So I'm gonna take you along while I get all my stuff packed and hopefully have a very smooth and wonderful vacation. So I've discovered I don't know what I'm doing or why I'm packing right now. Not why I'm packing, but I can't figure out what I should take. I have put together like a bunch of black tights and t-shirts. I've got my bathing suit. I've got like a shorts as a bathing suit cover up, like if I'm leaving the pool or whatever, if we even get into a pool. I've got, I'm gonna take running shoes and I'm gonna take flip flops and I packed like a couple of pairs of pants for the kids too because they say it's like it's higher elevation it's gonna get colder one hoodie for myself two hoodies each for the kids there's a washing machine there so i'm hoping this is fine so i really don't know i've got their clothes for the morning all taken out i've got a bunch of other random things that i folded on the floor got a bunch of suitcases going here i've decided to take out the sheets and the towels harper's brother called and was like it, like it's like a cottage that's like a hotel like it's a, basically they have a full like cleaning done before it comes in and there's a washing machine there so we're gonna take that out of our luggage because we already have so much stuff i mean obviously we have three kids we're gonna have so much stuff and harper was like if we really feel the need to we'll pull everything off the beds and wash in the machine and dry it and put it back on before we before we sleep in them, which I think is a better option. I don't want to carry all this stuff there. So things that I am packing based on your guys' recommendation include like a first aid kit. And in my first aid kit is basically band-aids and some rubbing alcohol. As you can see, I'm not a person who's like made to be in mountains and cottages. So my parents have a cottage and it's amazing, but it's like close by. This is like seven hours away. So packing becomes a challenge, but I heard there's a lot of stores close by. So let's hope for the best. We're like an hour away and the kids did really 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 great. Did you guys do so great on the drive? Go, 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 yeah. go. So we're almost there. Harpy drove all the way because he's so nice. There's nothing to say. He's very tired and no grumpy and grumpy and grouchy. How am I grumpy? That's kind of You're not talking to the marmy. It's pretty rude. It's pretty rude. The marmy never talks to me. The marmy never, the marmy is always talking to you. I was, was like, oh, Harpy, take over the vlog. We want to see Harpy. Tina, go away. <laughs> it's true. See, look at that big smile. He knows it's true. Are you guys good? Are you ready to get to this cottage? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's not raining right now, so let's hope that it's not going to rain the entire time while we're there. And let's hope we get some sunshine and some fun time outdoors. But the kids have been really good the entire trip, so we're lucky and we're almost there. So we made it to the cottage and we want to show it to you before everything becomes a mess. It will shortly, slowly but surely. Here's this kitchen, it's very cute. I love these red stools. And it has like a, is this called a meditation room actually? Yeah, so this is, so. it's a meditation room, we think. The kids are in there watching videos. It's all good, but they're having a good time. Then we have this room here. Ajith is here, very tired watching, watching Cars 3. And there is like, this is the lake. You can see, I'm not gonna open this because of like mosquitoes, but the lake is like right there. This is a nice deck you can see out onto the road. And there's like one bedroom up here and then three downstairs. And I gotta tell you, like this meditation room is my new favorite thing. I'm gonna have to have my coffee here in the morning. In the morning. Like a true brown person, the first thing I did when I came here is start to uh, cooking kitcheny for the kids, which is like lentils and rice mixed with vegetables. There's just so much junk food on the way here. And like, because we're vegetarian, it's like they're not, they're just eating like either pizza or grilled cheese or whatever, we do eat eggs, like egg sandwiches and stuff like that. So I'm making the lentils and rice mixed with vegetables because I was like, yeah, they need to have some nutrition and fiber and rubbish in there. So 
It's almost ready. Well, no, it's not almost ready, but it smells really good. Thankfully, I was able to find everything in this grocery store, like garlic, ginger paste, everything. Like, I'm lazy. I don't like to cut garlic and ginger, but I found everything I needed. And I actually even found lentils, like Indian lentils at the store. So I'm really, really happy because this is like actually, we're in Pennsylvania. Um, so we are just like just outside of New York, but in Pennsylvania. And it's like Pocados. Like, it's not really... I, I don't think this is a super diverse area. I don't know, I could be wrong. I don't think it is, but I'm surprised that I was able to find everything I need. Rice, lentils, everything. So, the kids are having fun. And we're gonna check in. I think today's just gonna be low key. We're probably gonna check in tomorrow. Hopefully there's no raining and flooding. There's no raining right now. So hopefully, hopefully after the good night's sleep, the kids will be able to have some fun tomorrow. So day two, it's raining like crazy here in Pocono Mountains. So we brought them to like an indoor playground to burn off some energy. Because we couldn't even leave the house. We tried to go for a walk twice and they started pouring rain on us. Hey, Gabirios. So this place is kind of cool and it's nice that it's close by. Careful, go, go, go. Go, go. Careful, careful. Go, careful. Come down. Together. Careful. Good job. Good job. Here come videos. Good morning, Marmy. So it's Tuesday, and I am in Tobihana State Park. I think that's how you say it. Tobihana, yeah, Tobihana State Park. And the kids just went ahead of me in the car because <laughs> we were trying to find our other brother-in-laws and sister-in-laws because we were a little bit late getting here. The kids were hungry, and so we stopped to get them some like egg sandwiches from McDonald's first. And so now we can't find them. So there's like a boat rental place up here. We're gonna see if we can rent like a little canoe or something. So I told those guys to go in the car and I would walk and get my steps in because there's been a whole lot of food eating since I've been here. And last night, I didn't even get a chance to vlog it, but last night was pretty late. Ajit was already asleep. Uh, my brother-in-laws and sister-in-laws bought me a birthday cake, so it was really, really sweet. So I got to cut a birthday cake. And there was, it was one of those cakes where there's like four different types of cake. And uh, yeah, I got to taste everything. We were gonna try to go boating. So I'm going to switch footage over to my iPhone because I do not need this camera to get wet or in the water. So I'm gonna use my iPhone as best I can if I can get some footage. We'll see. On boat. How was that cupcake, Jora? You look like you enjoyed it. Bahal, are you eating chips? Poor girl's so hungry. We got back so late from the state park. No, you can't have another cupcake. Finish what you have. Carpet's here. We're going some pasta. Don't do that, please. You better not have got sauce on my camera. Oh yeah, so, so, so yeah, my sister-in-law me making pasta. Harper's just like stirring it and trying to get credit for it. Okay, Jora, you look ridiculous. Look. Kabir, <laughs> why do you have a spoon? Do you want to pour it from the stove or do you want to bring it up to the table? Oh, it's hungry. Yeah. Oh, looks good. So this is it. Well, Harper, it looks good. I'm gonna have pasta for it's dinner. Me. It's me. Yeah, she's the one who made it. You just stirred it at the end and you were like, oh, look at me. I, I made this pasta. No, I give, give uh, credit to Dalji. Oh, yeah, yeah. Dalji cut the vegetables. So, Dalji's my brother in law. He cut the vegetables. He needs some credit, too. He needs some credit. Oh, we're gonna give the overall. I don't know. I don't know where Dalji is. So, 
We went to that state park today, to the lake. We went boating for like hours and hours. I tried to get some footage on my iPhone, so hopefully you saw some. I didn't want to take my camera near the water. And now everyone's supposed to be eating dinner. Paige, you have to go eat dinner. They're following me into this like lovely meditation room. Go eat dinner. He's like, no, no. Say hello. Say hi. <laughs> so that's it. We're leaving tomorrow morning, and um, yeah, it's almost time to call it a night. I haven't showered like all day because I was like, we're gonna be outside in the rain. We were first gonna go hiking, then the rain stopped, then we went to the lake, and yeah, I, I just gave the kids a bath. They ate. They're gonna go to bed soon. I'm gonna sit now and relax. <laughs> okay, it's it's time for you to have dinner. Let's go have dinner. Let's go have pasta. Your mama's waiting for you. Let's go have pasta. Let's go. Let's taste it. Good beer. Baby Boss the movie. You wanna watch Baby Boss the movie? Yeah. Yeah, you look so you look so cute. Let me see. Look, you're so fresh. You took a shower? Hey, don't do that. No, don't do that, please. That's not allowed. Say, so, did you have fun here in Poconos? Yeah. You did? Do you wanna come back here again? Yeah. You know we're leaving in the morning, right? <laughs> Say yes, we're going home tomorrow. Say we're going home tomorrow. Say we're going home tomorrow. Please come here. No, we are going home tomorrow. We are. We are. No matter how many times you nod like that. We have to go home tomorrow. Alright. Let's watch the baby boss. That's what we're going to do, right? Woo what are you doing? Bottle flips? Bottle flips. Two for two. Bottom line. That was a crazy run right there. That was a crazy run right there. That was a you didn't know that full bottle, Dad, right? Mommy, Ask Dada, what did Dada mommy, say? You want to have a full bottle? I have a full bottle. In a Gatorade bottle, I did a cup with a Gatorade bottle. Alright guys, this is the end of our trip. I'm hoping to just go down and take a shower now because it's been a busy day. I um, I'm going to be ending the vlog here because we're driving home tomorrow and this video is supposed to come out tomorrow morning and I obviously I have no time editing it until 9 o'clock. So I'm going to call it a day here or call it the end of our trip. Thank you so much for joining us on our trip to Pocono Mountains. It's a bit of a rough start to the trip, but I think overall everyone had a really great time. So I hope you guys had fun joining us for this trip. And if you did join us again next time, if you enjoy our vlogs and videos, subscribe to our channel and stay well. Enjoy the morning. March on, Marmy.